Hello, welcome back to Strike Gumbra. Today I'm quite free today because uh, next Monday will be a lockdown in Singapore. So uh, I bought a f- two boxes. One is a Warhammer Beast Grave, uh, the Dharma, and a Warhammer 4000. A McFarlane toys figure. Okay, so uh, let me start with this uh, Warhammer Beast Grave. Okay, I I saw this box at M Workshop and find this quite interesting. Uh, there are at least six Dharma. Okay, one is a rocks with uh, smoke and fire. This I think is a uh, like a toxic pool with the rocks. Rocks with crystals, uh, rocks with a demon head, rocks with a I think a dinosaur, dinosaur fossil, and this is a rocks with some kind of tentacles uh, 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 creature. Okay, so I proceed the out of box. Okay, so uh, you see it's for it's for gaming but to me I just want to build and paint. Uh, should be very easy. Okay, so apparently oh uh, very simple there are only two pieces. Okay. So the the user manual is a black and white but easy to understand. Especially you look at the the demon head right it's very easy just C1 and C2 pop go down that's it okay. so let's go to the kit itself actually the kit is quite or oh, quite de- as, as usual it's very detailed so if you look at this crystal this crystal right it's a a whole piece see it's one whole piece one solid piece it's not uh, for the the rest is a uh, hollow but it still looks very good. Okay. And the, the so called the smoke uh, is really one whole piece, not hollow. So you see, it's uh, quite worth for money. Uh. Uh, those uh, games of shop stuff is very worth for money. And this one is the uh, so called toxic pool. Uh. Then you have the, you see, the, uh, see, the bubbles and stuff. So you just have to spray white and luminous green and that's it. The rest you can just hand paint the rocks and stuff. But first hand paint the rocks, then after followed by the toxic pool. Then you can put can put some uh, UV uh, uh, UV resin uh, to make it glossy. Okay. Then oh okay. Next is the so-called the dinosaur fossil. Uh, it looks very good. Once you paint it, uh, it will look like a fossil. You, uh, skull is very easy to paint. Okay, and the devil's the the devil skull. It's a rector knot, tall rector knot. Okay, actually looks nice. Eh? I'm not sure if they can 3D print this kind of things. If can, I can print a lot of pieces. Looks very nice. Okay, so I'll see how I want to paint this guy. Maybe I can bring chrome. Hmm. Yeah, I think I can do that. Uh, I I gloss, gloss. Uh, so I make this guy luminous and glow in the dark. Then this one maybe make make it a uh, uh, chrome. Okay, chrome brown chrome. You looks good. Okay. So when I. Okay, I will do another video for this build. It will be very interesting. Okay. Let me keep this again. Okay, I'll put one side first. Or maybe later I'll do something about it. Let's see how. Okay, then uh, because of the, we call it circuit breaker, so I need to buy some stuff. Uh, so called to kill my time. So this one, uh, I find this interesting. This is a, um, what is it called? Let me see. Oh, uh, Adapta Sororitas Battle Sister. Ah, this proof. It's a 
female. It looks nice. It comes in grey, so meaning uh, we can actually paint it ourselves. Okay, let's open open this. Actually, there's a smell. I don't know what smell is that. And it also comes with a or oh, oh, a stand. Okay, this stand is is sealed. Hey, open. I don't have finger nails. So. Okay. Sorry that I did not post any videos. I was very busy at work. Okay, there's a lot of things to be done at this end of the year. Company needs to earn money. Okay, so I will not keep the box. So this is a uh, the stand. I won't want this. Uh, the, uh, and the toys come with this uh, secure plastic threads. Uh. Okay. So it's my nipple. Wow, this is quite heavy. Oh. Mm, for a forty dollars, forty two dollar toy. I bought it from I bought this from Latendo. Okay, quite sturdy. Okay, next is the nine. So 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 not nine. Okay, uh, the this is the sword. It's a bit uh crooked, but it's okay. Uh, just go through the hot water treatment. I'll straighten this up. Okay. And the figure, figure, figure. The packaging is quite sturdy. Eh? So it's kind of uh, difficult to bring this out. I just ah. Definitely is a oh this is very soft. This one I will use acrylic paint. I will use like it will crack. Anyway, I don't think we will need any primer for this. Okay, so uh, it's a movable toy. Okay, um, the issue is how to paint this, and I believe all these things can be removable. Okay, let me see the backpack. Ah, uh. oh, can remove. Okay, good. Look at that. The backpack is quite nice. Okay. And, uh, but all these are rubber. So this will be very tricky. I think we need acrylic for this. 
These are rubber also, rubber, rubber. Uh, the hand a bit like um, it's a bit like ABS. This one is still rubber. So uh, this one is ABS, ABS, ABS. Eh, no, this shit. This rubber is a bit soft. You see, it's hollow. But overall, it looks very nice. Uh, we'll I'll see how to paint this this lady. Okay, need to figure out how to remove some stuff lah. But most probably we'll have to hand paint lah. Have to hand paint. Okay, because it depends how we're going to remove all this stuff. Okay, uh, most probably hand paint. Uh, yeah, we will just hand paint. I think it looks good. Overall, this this the details are very very nice, very good. Okay, uh, this head I can do some chrome. Okay, I will straighten this sword out. This uh, gun, uh, I think I yeah, there's some more lines. Okay, let me zoom in. Ah, see. There's some more lines here, so we need to send some of this stuff. Okay. So uh, the right hand is fixed. Uh. You, it will, it is meant to hold this gun. So it's, it's actually a toy. So you put it there to the trigger. Yeah, this is how it looks like. Let me pinch the finger into the trigger guard. It's it's, it's just a toy lah. So, uh, have to use have to use acrylic because only the uh, acrylic uh, acrylic after dry right, will become a quite a thick membrane. Then we can do some uh, weathering and stuff using acrylic. Most probably this 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 lady here will be. Painted in acrylic, especially all this. Uh, all this is soft, la. It's very soft. Okay. Uh, likely we, it won't crack because I won't keep moving this lady. This one I'm not sure. I have to try. Okay. I will try. Well, I have some acrylic primer. Again, again. But I need to start to see how to dismantle. Uh, this every piece uh. so I put in my display first uh, when I have time then I will I will do the painting for this lady quite a nice figure actually okay so you have the stand stand up Ooh, not very see, not very sturdy okay. but it's fine uh. anyway if once I paint I will put on it Dharma base and some of the joints I will just fix it with super glue. I'm not going to uh, uh, make it possible or anything. So all in all, this uh, this figure is very nice. If you want to buy, you can go to Latendo. I think they still they still have one or two boxes. Uh, not a lot. Okay. So uh, today is just to share what I bought. Uh, today for the circuit breaker and I can move around my uh, okay let me show you some of the stuff I've done recently which I don't have time to video I just keep building when I'm very tired but I just want to build something so I started Zazabi okay and look at this this is the Psycho Zaku backpack so I'm going to attach this uh, backpack Onto the sasabi. Okay, and you see, this is the evidence of my works in progress. Okay, so uh, sasabi, I did the the full kit, the body and the shield. Then the uh, I start building the psycho sasabi backpack. To see how I'm gonna fit the 
the back of the sasabi. Some modifications are needed. La. So uh, do stay tuned. Uh, because I, I think in the video I will just start with this, this video itself. If not, the, the process is very very long. You will just sleep. Uh. Okay. So uh, uh, circuit breaker is starting. So you will see more videos from me. Stay tuned. And uh, I will come back soon. Bye.